Castillo. Mm-hmm. Were there any other questions I could answer for you? Um... No, there's uh, nothing you can do. Thanks. Mmm, I think you should wear this one. This one? Mm-hmm. Oh, I don't know, honey. I think that's this is a little too much for a family dinner. Well, Mama, this is a real celebration, and you said you didn't mind celebrating. Just the way you talk about you and Daddy and the special time that you spent at the diner. Well, you know, we were, I mean, we were a little frightened doing what we were doing. But it was, it was really wonderful at the same time. It just, it just brought back so many memories of being in that funny little place again where we used to secretly meet all the time. And, and one of the best memories, the one that we recreated the other night, <laughs> was the two of us dancing all alone to the jukebox. And then his holding me in his arms. And I'm watching the sun come up together. <laughs> mm, that sounds romantic. Yeah. Yeah, but the music stops and you can't just keep on dancing forever. Oh, but Mama, those are things you have to look forward to. Some people never have them. No. And I wish I... I just wish it could be enough. Didn't Dr. Kelton explain this whole procedure to you? They're supposed to do that before the woman even takes it. Yeah, he explained it to me, but I thought maybe he'd left something out since the results were inconclusive, or maybe you'd remember something about the test. No. You know, anything at all that was unusual about it might help. I mean, there must have been a reason it was in inconclusive. My, wi my wife's name is Eden Castillo. Look, I don't deal with names, just numbers. Well, I'm aware of that, but you would remember if there was something very unusual about a test, right? I do a lot of different kinds of tests every day with a lot of different procedures. There's nothing I haven't seen. But I'd never remember one test. It, it, it's just a number. It's just a number. Well, it, that's what it may be to you, pal, but to people who are waiting on the results, it could be a hell of a lot more than that, believe me. started mm. what's wrong I uh, lied to you about going back to work this afternoon where did you go I went to the hospital to see if I could uncover something about the paternity of the baby to see if they'd overlooked something Did you find out anything else? Nothing. But everything, you know. I don't understand. I have. I, I am. Uh, I'm ashamed of myself. For lying. Yeah, for lying. I have been keeping the way I feel about this to myself. Well, that's not lying. It is. It, it to me, it is. I. I try to pretend it's, it's for you, but it's not. It's for myself. I'm afraid. I'm like some little kid who won't go out in the dark, you know? Except it's not really the dark I'm afraid of. It's, 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 my, it's me, you know? I'm, it's my fear of... I'm afraid I'm going to destroy myself. Sweetheart. You're never scared of anything. Well, that's what I'd like you to believe. The truth is, Eden, that I'm not sure how I'm going to react if this baby is not mine. No. No, it's the way I feel. I already know. No. Believe me, it's different this time. In the past, I've always been able to just... find a way to get past stuff like this. But, I mean, I, I'm really worried. I'm afraid this is going to mess things up for you and me. Nothing is going to mess anything up for you and me. Nothing. But I look, but I'm, 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 I'm lying. I, 
But to protect me? But it's not, the, it's not, it's wrong to do that. It's it is destructive. not wrong. Look at me. You love me. It's never wrong to do something for somebody that you love. How can you say that? I know you have your doubts, and I know you have your fears. And I know in my heart that this baby is ours. And even if it wasn't, you and I were big enough to love this baby as much as we love each other. We're going to make it. We'll always make it. I promise you.